What's going on guys? Soccer Place here coming at you with another Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. And uh, so today we'll pretty much be doing the normal play one solo chapters today, mainly because it is a weekday, so three minute videos. Uh, let's collect the gems. And yep, pretty much I've been logging on to Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel for a week. So those are the best, bon easiest bonuses you can get from any game that has them. So let us head into solo, and as you, if you didn't, just take a quick look and pretty much dual pass, I'm above 50, 54, with 68 more days to go. So I mean, it's not bad. Uh, I did achieve gold rank. I'm kind of testing out a new deck in gold rank, so I don't, just to see how well it does. But yeah, so pretty much, yeah, I did not complete Mystery of Megalith. The, or the Proxene Warriors, mainly because I haven't had the time. I just kind of got back from work and I already grabbed my grubs so, for dinner. So today we'll be doing the glory of the Gladiator Beast. So Gladiator Beast beckon other beasts with amplified effects. The stage is set for a frenzied fray. So we'll be going over that story today. Pretty much like normal, I handle the lock off screen in my own time. We just go through the scenario practice duel and then goal. But yeah, with the, the with the duel, pretty much we use I will use the loner deck, and then uh, one of my decks I'll probably use the deck that I've been using normally, and we get Earth Orbs. Sweet. All right, let us get into the scenario. So I hope you guys are already enjoying your day. The glory of the gladiator beasts. In ancient times, a great empire ruled the world. The city was prosperous and its inhabitants lived in peace. War was a thing of faraway lands. The aristocrats, unknowing of the danger, decided to build a great amphitheater, the Colosseum. Therein, gladiator beasts fought to the death for sport. Tournaments were held day and night to satisfy the latent bloodlust of the aristocrats. Long live the Emperor! Salute the dying heroes! Sorry guys, just fixing the mic. At the blast of a horn, a fierce battle begin, would begin, in which the beasts would fight with the claws, fangs, and any weapons available. At the Colosseum, those who captivated the crowds were lavished with praise. This spurred on the gladiator beasts who risked great peril for the spectators' cheers. The Empire enjoyed the very height of prosperity, but a small spark would set it on a path to destruction, and with the decline of the Empire, the frequency of fighting tournaments decreased. The aristocrats sealed the Colosseum for eternity, for fear that the gladiator beasts who'd lost their battleground might revolt. Many years passed since the fall of the empire and the Colosseum decayed over time. But one day, the ground with faded bloodstains shined and the gladiator beasts appeared. Among the seats along, among the seats long empty as spectators, the starting horn once again echoed Long live the Empire, salute the dying heroes. Inside the Colosseum, reigned by the decaying city, the gladiator beasts fought once again. And in jubilation of their heroic travails, the cheers of the aristocrats could be could once more be heard. Sorry for the slight lag, my laptop wasn't isn't charging, so it was kind of running on battery power. It works better when, when it's charging because power's going in while a lot of it is being used. So practice. So the Lunar Deck, we got our Fusion and Link Monster. Well, yeah, few, pretty much majority Fusion and Link Monsters. Uh, Raigeki, Harpy's Feather, Duster, Monster Reborn, good spells. Uh, search cards, so that's good. Test Tiger, Test Panther, okay. Uh, what's our fusion spell for the deck? Ah, we'll find it when we do the practice. 
But yeah, so that's pretty much it. Majority fusion, so I don't mind. Because there is a lot of ways for fusion summoning now. Before it was just polymerization as like the primary. What makes a gladiator beast deck unique? Gladiator beasts, monsters have effects that allow you to return them to the deck after the battle phase if they battled. And special summon a gladiator beast of a different name from your deck. This way of special summoning gladiator beast monsters allows you to unlock even more of their effects. Moreover, you do not need polymerization to special summon gladiator beast fusion monsters. You can simply special summon them by returning the necessary materials on your field to the deck. Okay, that's good. So it's like a sort of sort of uh, sort of fusions. Like you pretty much like how cards you contribute them to the graveyard in order to bring out those kinds of requirements. So. Use the cards in your hand and rouse the gladiator beasts to win the battle duel. Uh, start by activating the continuous spell Gladiator Rejection. Uh, your opponent cannot target gladiator beasts. Beasts, okay. Haplomas. Yeah, I'm pretty much gonna not say the gladiator beast portion, mainly because it's kind of repetitive for majority of them. Test Tiger. Now we'll try a special summon weight. One of the special ways to activate Gladiator Beast effects in fa main phase one, special summon Test Tiger from the hand. Okay. Face up attack. Test Tiger can return itself to the deck and special summon Gladiator Beast to utilize. Alright, so Test Tiger to the deck. Or Grave. Or, yeah, Test Tiger to the Grave deck. Or test tiger to the grave, the other or to the deck. Activate the effects of bestiary that you special summon and gladiator rejection respectively. Okay, so select a card to destroy. Okay. Uh, place a counter. All gladiator beast monsters gain. Okay. That's more of a useful spell on me. And we get him out. Now two gladiator beasts are on the field. Special summon the fusion monster. Geyser is from the deck, extra deck. So you. Return you and you. So that's nice how they return to the deck. So pretty much like you kind of have a almost endless supply sort of in order for you to get out two of your bigger cards or one of your bigger cards destroy two of your opponent's cards on the field. Activate his effect. So from that, select that. Let's, yeah, okay. Attack your opponent's life points directly. Battle. Attack. By shuffling. Okay. Man, I couldn't read it. Sorry, just need a drink of water. Because I'm going to be talking a lot. But I do hope water were... Alright. Duel with Loner. But yeah. So I hope you guys are enjoying your Wednesday. Uh, me, I pretty much went to class at like 9.30 and then went straight to work after. So pretty much ended, shift ended at 4. Yada yada. That was my day. Activate Gladiator Rejection. When this card is special summon tar Uh, One Gladiator Beast in the Grave. I'll just summon higher attack. In the duel. Uh, at the end of the battle phase, if this card attacked or was attacked, you can shuffle it to the deck. Special summon one gladiator beast. Okay. Uh, same with that. Okay, so I guess they all majority have the same effect. If they battled, return to the deck. Alright. 
straw. Upset. Uh, target. So target one. Glide your base card in the graveyard. Add that target to the hand. Oh, okay. Uh, don't paddle. Or wait. At the end of the battle phase, yeah, they would have to battle. And all of them are special summons, so. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but a car alarm is going off. While you control that, all monsters your opponents, your opponent controls must attack. Fable, once per turn, you can shuffle one gladiator beast from your hand or graveyard into the main deck, then target one gladiator beast control. Yeah, activate. Yes. Shuffle you to the deck. Gain the attack. Oh wait, maybe I should have done it during the battle phase. Yeah, probably should have done it during. Oops. Or he still attacks, okay. Activate his effect. Alright, and uh Get him out. Face up attack. Uh, your opponent cannot target grab gladiator beast monsters you control except with card effects. Except during the battle phase, if a gladiator beast monster is special summoned from your extra deck, you can special summon one monster from your deck. Uh, yeah, special summon a monster from the deck. Hmm. This card is special summoned by the effect of Glider Beast. Its original defense comes. Uh, which one will let me get something from the grave? Uh, at the start of damage step, you can special summon this card. Yeah, alright. I'll just bring out big, big cards. Change to attack. Uh, what can I special summon? Uh, this guy. Uh, two gladiator beasts. Okay, so nothing. Cancel. Um, at the end phase, if this card was attacked. All right, set you face down. Battle. Attack. Activate that. Return him to the deck. Confirm. Boost and attack. And then. Okay. End the turn there. Yep. Shuffle you to the deck. Uh, when I effect negate that. No. No. Two thousand defense. Yes. Some one guards the grave. You can target gladiator beast monster in your graveyard. Special so summon that target, but negate its effects. Uh. uh discard one gladiator beast card. I'll just do you. Yes. Rejection. I'm just triggering all the effects. Special summon. Special summon you. Okay. Activate. Boost you. Oh, wait. Oh, it's just the attack. Oh, cried. Cried. 
Ouch. I might have screwed up there. Uh, cancel. Okay, yeah. Alright, activate. Destroying him. Call the haunted. Okay, yeah. All gladiator beast monsters for each of these counters. Okay. Draw. Activate you. No. Lower. Yeah, a lot of these guys are special summons. Alright, but I'll just get you. Summon you. Fusion summon. Three gladiator beast monsters. Cannot be destroyed by battle if this card attacks or is attacked. Your opponent cannot activate card effects until the end of the damage step. At the beginning of the battle phase, if this card attacked or was attacked, you can shuffle it to destroy some. Okay. One, two, three. Face up. Effect activate. Strengthening him. Confirm. Battle. Attack. And activate the effect. Sun two. Sorry, it was. If this card shuffle it's a great extra deck. Okay, yeah. So one now you face up attack face up defense. Uh, Atroxy, you can send one gladiator beast from your deck or extra deck to the grave, except this. This card's level and name become the same at the end of the battle phase if this card battled. No. Rejection yes. Okay, target one face up monster. Yes. Oh, did it have its effects negated? Oh my gosh, I have no clue whose car that is. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I do apologize if you can. Activate you. Return you. And boost you. That. It, right, it's still the it's, it's attack. Right, right, right. I keep forgetting that, but it's fine because I can return it. Uh, who can I special summon? Cancel. Summon you. Yes, tribute you. There we go. Right, battle. Effect you. Who has the? They're both at eight hundred. All right. So, just boost you. Attack you. No, I should have attacked him. It's fine though. End the turn. If this card, uh, special on one was. Yep. To bring you out. Face up attack. Gladiator rejection. 21. No, no. That's 21. 16. Iris defense. So. No. I won't activate your effect. I want to keep you on the board. As much as possible. Uh, cancel. Cancel. So 
700, 800, cancel. Okay. Cancel. Uh, equip, it cannot be destroyed by battle. Okay. My go. Draw. Effect, activate. Not yet. Uh, target one, glad you understood that target. No. If this card was special, it can attack twice during each battle phase at the battle end. Alright. Well, really, doesn't matter because I'm. Uh, I'll just do you. Yeah. Alright. Summon you. You by shuffling cards to. Alright. Okay, so. Doing 2800. No. Cancel. Just go straight to battle. Activate you by sending you. Cancel. Activating none of their effects. Maybe I should say, eh, it's fine. It's fine. Cancel. Activate this effect. Okay. No, I don't know why he would do that. Okay. They return to his hand or something? Yep, they get returned to the hand. Hmm. All right. That called the haunted still on the field. Okay. That's fine. Draw. Change its battle position. Uh, select one glider bear. Uh, activate you. Select one monster on the your opponent controls. Change its battle position to defense. Uh, go I'll just go straight to battle. What? Can it not be destroyed while in defense? Oh, man. Send you back to the deck to get something. Uh, send one monster from your deck or extra deck to the graveyard. Now. Yes. Now. Man. Okay. Draw. Uh, target face up cards on the field to, up to the number you control. Set. Special summon. Level 10. Vespius. Oh, huh. Uh, by shuffling the above cards in the grave, once per turn, when your opponent activates a monster effect, you can negate the effect. If you do destroy it, you can choose the attack targets of your opponent at the. At the okay, yeah. So choose you, 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 and you. Face up. Nope. 
battle. Oh, right, because of that. The end of the turn. No. Keep my strongest cards out. That's what. That's right. Select target monster to attack. Choose you. Cancel. He just ends himself. Yeah. Bet. Wow, that took more than 10 minutes. Jeez. Okay, gain a bit of levels. But that's fine. Got 150 wind orbs. Locked portion. I do clear myself, but... Let's just quickly end this. Uh, Otis Pendulum. Select. Yes. Play. Just beat him with my Otis deck. Hopefully I, it can go quickly. Because I still got some more work to do. Alright, Stargazer, Time Gazer. Get me an Odd Eyes. Pendulum. Face up attack. Um, face up defense. Face up attack. Face up defense. Yes. Activate Harmonizing Magician. And I'll, sh I'll get another one of you. Track oh, right. Defense. It comes in defense. Uh, who can I swap? Uh, decode Talker. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah. Harmonizing Magician can be used for Fusion, Synchro, or Xyz. Doesn't say anything about Link, so. It came out before Link, so. Yeah. Works out. Battle. Uh. Odd Eyes gets more out of that. Attack. Alright. Though it's not an OTK, it'll be a turn 3 kill. Pretty much. Or, no, turn 4 kill. Alright. Draw. <clears throat> Pendulum. Persona. And you. Oh, wait. Uh, there. Yeah, right there. Battle. Not eyes. Attacks. Nope. That'll do it. All right, that is the duel. Less than five minutes. Wow. All right. And now to the goal and towards the end of five, 150 Dark Orbs. Sweet. All right. So we get the Gladiator deck. Let us continue. The Gladiator Beast enacted various contests as if in response to the voices of invisible spectators. One-on-one -on -one combat, platoon battles, sieges, navy battles. And when their excitement peaked, the seal that bound the bravest of the gladiator beasts was broken. In close combat, platoon battles, they were the gladiator beasts, beasts proud of their iron physiques. And their large-scale sieges, 
they were bird gladiator beasts, most active in raiding parties and aerial assaults. In the naval battles at the Colosseum, they were the gladiator beasts of fish and sea serpent form who drew their prey down into the dark waters. And the deadly weapons that they wield, wielded, battle machines and chariots, were revived. The Colosseum regained its glory due to the brave heroics of the gladiator beasts. When the fervor of their contests reached an epic crescendo, the gates of the Colosseum were opened and their terrifying death march commenced. Well, that'll do it. That's it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed just this uh, chapter. And uh, no, don't want to go to it. But yeah, with that, with this clear, yeah, we haven't un not unlocked anything yet. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, more another video will be up tomorrow. But I hope you guys have a nice day, and pretty much, I won't also. I also won't be kind of opening a, a pack today, mainly because I got some work, and I did open some yesterday. So, but I hope you guys have a nice day. This is Saga Plays signing out. Bye.